You have any idea how this bullet got in the wall? This isn't fun and games, Vincent. I'm done with you. Now, you know the rules, baby. It isn't over until I say so. And let's kiss and make up. No. I said, let's kiss and make up. I said, no. Are, are you sure that's even a bullet hole? See for yourself. Well, what do you know? You took the words right out of my mouth. What do you know that you're not telling me, Vincent? Who fired a gun in here? Well? Well, what? Who fired the gun that left his bullet in the wall? Like I told you, I don't know. Are you sure that's even a bullet? Uh, yeah. Uh, don't touch it. It's evidence. Of what? A crime? Uh, you tell me. How can I tell you something I don't know? Are you protecting your sources? You're a tabloid reporter, right? Did you meet someone here to buy a story from them? Did they want more money than you were willing to give them, so they shot the place up? No. Then what happened? Who fired this bullet into the wall? I wish I could help you, Paloma, but I can't. Now, I don't know who fired that bullet, much less when, because I didn't hear a gunshot. You know, like I said, I was in the bathroom with the water running, and the next thing I knew, you're here accusing me of lying to you. I want you to be straight with me. I am. Besides, why would I lie? If someone tried to shoot me, don't you think I'd be begging for your help? Not necessarily. You tabloid types live by a different set of rules. Look, for all we know, that bullet in the wall could have been there for years. No, the entry hall is still fresh. Well then, maybe someone in the drive-by shooting had lousy aim. Which would explain why you heard the gunshot and why I don't know what happened. Except that the angle of the hole indicates that the shot was fired from inside this room. I don't know what to say. All right, look for the gun if you want. I have to finish getting dressed. I didn't know we were finished yet. A am I under arrest? No. Then we're done. If Paloma got pulled in to do an extra shift tonight, she would have left a note, but I just... I'll call my dad, find out what's going on. <clears throat> oh, hey, uh, hey, where'd you go? I heard a gunshot not long after you left, so I went to investigate. Are, are you okay? I mean, they weren't shooting at you, were they? No, no, I'm fine. I'm just confused. I could swear the gunshot came from the room next door, but when I went to check it out, I found Vincent, the tabloid news reporter, coming out of the bathroom. You mean he's our wall-banging moaner? I was too focused on finding who fired the gun and why to ask him. Oh, uh, rightfully so. Uh, so what did he say what happened? Uh, he swore he didn't see or hear anything. Uh, but you don't believe him? No. So I looked around and I found this bullet stuck in the wall. What? what is it? it so what did he say when you showed him the evidence that someone had fired a gun? Oh, well, he suggested it could have been a drive-by shooting, but that doesn't add up. You know, it's funny. There's something that I've been thinking about that doesn't add up either. What do you mean? Well, when I was bringing the food back, I could have sworn I saw a... Sorry. It could be headquarters. Hello? Paloma. Hey, it's Whitney. Oh, Whitney, um, can I call you back? This is not a good time. Well, you know what? This won't take long. I just wanted to invite you and Noah to a surprise birthday party that I'm throwing for Chad tonight at the mansion, okay? Um, Noah and I had plans. Well, no, no, no. You have to come. I mean, you just have to. Chad is going to be so disappointed if you don't, and so will I. Okay, um, we'll be there. Great. Perfect. Trust me, you're going to have a blast. All right, bye. Mm. Uh, 
Oh, oh, oh God, that's incredible. <laughs> You're insatiable. Yeah, yeah. When is this good? I just lose control. <laughs> Sorry, wait, little, little. Uh, 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 you know, we should probably stop eating so we can eat a little at Chad's party. Uh, you're right. We'd better get going. All right. Oh, you know, speaking of Chad, I was going to tell you this before Whitney called, uh -huh. but I, I could have sworn I saw Chad running away from the motel when I came back with the food. Really? Are you, are you sure it was Chad? I'm positive. I, I called out to him, but he just kept on running. That's strange. Yeah. I mean, what would Chad be doing here? Unless Vincent was threatened to print a story about the cranes and Chad came to stop him. And you think Vincent shot the gun at Chad to get him to go away? I didn't see a gun, but that would make sense. All right, well, we got to talk to Chad about this at the party. Yeah. We've got to find out who fired the gun and why. Hey, Chad. Sorry we're late. Happy birthday. <laughs> Thanks. Look, there's a lot to eat and drink, so uh, enjoy yourselves, okay? Wait, wait, wait. I want to ask you, what happened at the motel today? What motel? Ah, oh, come off it, man. Come on, I saw you running away. I was calling after you, and you just kept going. 